Hello, welcome to video two in my series of how to improve your English. Today we're just going to concentrate on three words. Throughout, through and through. Three very similar words and people often get confused with them. Let's start with the top one. Throughout. Throughout. Very simple. Very simple. It means from the beginning all the way through. So for instance, my friend here, Roberto, has been with me throughout my time in Colombia. So seven years he's been with me throughout all the time. Is that right? Yes. Okay. So, and he probably will appear in every video. So throughout my videos, you will see Roberto. He really likes to help with these little jobs that we do. Okay. He's an important part of the family. So we include him. So throughout just means from here all the way through. You'll see him. Look, look, he's going throughout the video. He's going to be messing around. It's really pretty annoying, actually. I'm great. Okay. Go away. sit down there. Right. Now, so that's throughout. Now, through and through, these mean some, pretty much the same thing, okay? But the bottom spelling, T-H-R-U, is American. And give you an example, when are we going to do this? From Monday through Thursday. It means Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, and Thursday, inclusive. So there's a Monday and the Thursday included as well. Exactly the same spelling, Monday through Thursday, this middle word here as well, okay? Doesn't exist in English. We say from Monday to Tuesday, in Monday to Thursday inclusive. Um, Americans say through. But it can be through March, means from the beginning of March to the end of March inclusive. All the days included, okay? Now, the other word through, the normal, normal, normal meaning of through is, can be demonstrated by, this is why we have Roberto, okay now? This can be demonstrated. This is the word through. Look, look. Roberto puts his head through the piece of paper, through, from one side to the other, through, okay? Not to be confused with throughout. Through, it means to pass from one side to the other. So somebody falls through a window, they're inside of the building and they go through the window and they fall on the outside. Okay, you need to get through a problem, which means you start on this side of the problem, you end up on the other side of the problem. Okay, it might be better for you, it might be worse for you, but you get through the problem. You must pass from one side to the other. That's what through means. Okay, that's it. Just simple as that. Throughout means all the way through, and through means from one side to the other. Just always remember. Roberto's head sticking through a piece of paper and you'll never forget this really. Thank you. Bye-bye.